lecture, I will explain the basic memory instructions in assembly programming. This lecture will cover how to display memory contents and how to change memory contents. Also, load data from memory to register by using move instruction and store data in memory using move instruction. Dump instruction used to display the range of memory contents that we uh, want to display it. For example, if we want to display the contents of memory from uh, 700 D 700 it will display 128 bytes of memory starting from 700 okay up to 770 F okay which is the end this is 70 F now if I want to display just one row of memory I should write I can decide what's the range of display D from 700 up to 700 F there is a space between them okay press enter it will display just the first row because this is from 700 up to 700 F if I want to display two rows it will be D from 700 up to 700 and what's the end is F okay now press enter to row from uh, memory starting from 700 up to 700 uh, 700 uh, 1 71 F okay now how we can change the value of memory we can change it by using two instructions e instruction that's mean enter value to the memory and f instruction which is used to fill uh, memory contains with uh, same value now if we want to fill the memory with different values we will use e but if we want to fill number of memory locations with the same value, we will use F. I will show you what's the uh, difference between them. The value here from 1 to 4. Okay? 4 bytes, I want to change them. I will write E700, enter. We will press enter. It will give me a list of value, E, the address, and it will show me the list of value. This is E, the address, and this is the list, okay? Now I want to change to uh, 1, space, 2, 3, 4, okay? Another space, I will not enter any value. That means the first one, the first value, change it to 1. And the second byte change to 2. And the third one to 3, 4, and so on. Okay, now enter. I will display again. Display to 700F. Now, here the change. 1, 2, 3, 4, and this one I didn't change anything. Okay? Now, if I used F, F, if there's the same value, so I will write F from, let's, from uh, 720, I will fill value here, okay? Write F. Now, uh, we will fill uh, F, F value from 722 okay this is 20, 720 21 22 from here up to here okay so it would be 720 21 22 
23, 4, 5, 6, 7. Okay. Now, 700 up to 726. 26. Okay. Now, this is the range of my list. F, the range. And then, what's the value? What's the data that you want to fill it? So, I will say, for example, uh, 55. Okay. Now, enter. Let's display again. Display from 700. I will, I will display from the beginning. Okay. Just 700. Let's see what's the change. Display 700 from 700, 722. Okay. Up to uh, 26. The same value it will change the memory location to the same value. So this is the difference between uh, F instruction and E instruction. E for different values and F for uh, same value within the range. Okay. Now let's solve this example. Write assembly program to set three bytes of memory location to FF starting from 400 using move instruction. That's been we cannot use F command. From 400 and the CS value, that's mean the segment value, uh, whatever the segment value, we don't care about it. Just uh, We'll give the address for starting to write the program. Okay, three bytes. That's starting from uh, 400. That's mean 400, 401, and 402. These three bytes, and set it to FF. That's mean these three bytes should be FF after we execute our instruction. Now, this one of you, he will say, okay, it's easy. I can write move FF to 400 between brackets, brackets that mean the contains of 400, okay? And move FF to 401, move FF to 402, okay? But this is not correct. In assembly programming. Now move, for example, FF to 400. Okay, when I press enter, it's error. Same thing if we try to move data from one memory location to another memory location, this is also it's error, it's not correct. That's why we need to learn uh, coding. Now it's not allowed to write like these comments. You put zero for uh, your programming. Okay? Can you give me idea how to solve this problem? Okay. One of the student he said we can use to register with memory. Yes, it's correct. Because it's byte, we can put a byte of FF to BL and then move the BL to the contains of 400 and 401, 402. Yes, it's correct. Okay, we can make it less. We can solve it with a less number of commands or instructions. Yes. One of you, he said, okay, I can put two bytes in BX and then BX to the contains of 400, that's mean 400 and 401. And because it's three bytes, then we can use just BL to the 402. I cannot say BX to 402 because if I write BX, that's mean 402, 403. But the question said just three bytes. Okay. We can use another uh, codes. 
we can use SI register for uh, as uh, index to the memory for handling and then move FF to BL and then BL to SI BL to SI plus 1 that's mean 400 401 and 402 it's correct yes now I can make this instructions less number of instructions yes we can use for handrent to put it in uh, SI and then BX BX to SI that's mean SI and SI plus 1 and then BL to SI plus 2 all of them they are correct but which one it's the perfect one now we will search about which instructions needs to uh, change a minimum change now if I change the question to 700 here how many number of changes I need I, I should change 700 701 702 three changes here I need to two changes what about this one just I will change 400 to 700 and I will not change um, other instructions that means it's better here it's one change and here it's a uh, three two what about this one here also just one change I will change 400 to 700 and that's it the perfect program is the program that need to list number of change okay now we will choose one of them okay between these two which one is the perfect one that mean which one uh, uh, list number of comments this is the list number of comments okay so this is the perfect solution for this uh, example now let's try to implement the instruction we will display from 400 to 402 it is 0, 00 before we execute our program after execution should be ff 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 same instructions move 400 to si and then uh, ff to b high and below and then move it to contains of SI which is 400 and BL to SI plus 2 so after execution if we write the same instruction or same command D from 400 to 402 because it's just three bytes it will show me it's FF 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 try to implement this example on your uh, computer Thank you.